faculty members, and all the delegate, delegates present over here. I am honored to present the summary report of One Day International Multidisciplinary Conference in collaboration with International Council for Education, Research, and Training on the theme Contemporary Global Challenges and Opportunities in Education, Languages, Science, and Humanities organized by the Department of English on today itself. With a special reference to the conference, the event is commenced by invoking Almighty by Lamp Lightning Movement and Ma Saraswati Vandana, followed by introduction of guests and felicitation and welcome address by our respected principal, Professor Dr. Anita Rathi Ma'am, who emphasized the need and importance of organizing such an event in current scenario as well. Today's guest of honor and conference chair, Professor Dr. Aruna Achal Ma'am, addresses the gathering and express her deep inside view about the theme of contemporary global challenges and opportunities. Our honorable chief guest, Professor uh, Dr. Dilip Kumar M., Deputy Vice Chancellor of uh, Nile University, Malaysia, underlined the relevancy of the conference in present scenario. Then the program was taken further by our esteemed keynote speaker, Professor Dr. Som Shubra De. Uh, sir highlighted uh, staying in global village and breaking barriers of space and time and how opportunities of e-learning improved over the time. Our next esteemed keynote speaker, Professor Pramod Kumar Mehra, talked about the education knowledge in 21st century towards a newer understanding of global world literature very wonderfully and very beautifully. The inaugural ceremony ends with the release of abstract book by all the dignitaries and guests and session chairs, followed by a lot of thanks by myself. Seeing the huge response of the participants, four technical sessions were there. Each and every technical session began with the welcome address of the chairperson, followed by a brief introduction about the chairperson, themes and some sub-themes of the session. Technical session one was chaired by Dr. Eugenia Ma'am and coordinated by Ms. Mahima, Dr. Mani Mahajan and Dr. Sarika Sharma and near about 30 participants were there. Technical session 2 was chaired by Professor Dr. Rashmi uh, Ma'am and coordinated by Dr. Deeksha Rani, Dr. Sonia Gupta and Ms. Monica, Mrs. Monica and there are about same participants were there. Technical session three was chaired by uh, Dr. Rita Gaur Ma'am, coordinated by Dr. Ekta Chaudhary, Ms. Nikhat, and Dr. Anju Gupta, and the same strength of participants are there. Technical session four was chaired by Dr. Rajesh Kumar sir, and coordinated by Ms. Vidima Narayan, Ms. Priyanshi, and Dr. Uh, Shazia and the same strength of participants were there in technical session 4. In all the technical sessions, presenters presented their papers in offline as well as in online mode. Actually, there are about 19 presentations from India and 23 from foreign countries. Total registration are near about 200 uh, from India and others from uh, others uh, near about 14 countries India, Nigeria, Philippines, Malaysia, Pakistan, Onam, US, Serbia, Nepal, Indonesia, etc. presented their papers on uh, presented their presentations over the theme of the conference. There are 20 awards, awardees nominated for APJ Abdul Kalam Award 2023 for the award ceremony. Finally, the valedictory session is going on, which will be followed by award ceremony. So this is all about from my side, and I would just end the report 
by seeing the lines of one of the most famous writer in English literature, Robert Frost. The woods are lovely, dark, and deep, but I have promises to keep and mice to go before I sleep, and mice to go before I sleep. Thank you all.